We love hip hop. It's a question that I pondered in my mind. Mm-hmm. Okay. And I just want to get your quick opinion because I feel like our cameras are probably going to die on us here. Yeah. Is it harder to make it back in the days without social media or now, but everything is so saturated? Back in the day, it meant more. When you when people heard about me running around or any artists running around and get putting their mixtapes in a stores, mom and pop shops, getting the receipt here and telling people, yo, go get my CD. It's over here, a mega mixtape. Boom, 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 boom. Like, bro, that's but different. Was it harder? But uh, then, any, then what we got to do, what the people got to do now. Yeah, it was harder, but I, I would rather that harden it, like pause, but I'd rather that way of it coming to me because mm-hmm. then then you would actually work at the craft better and then you wouldn't, you wouldn't like you would actually second guess yourself back in the day. Mm. Now man's put on a one auto tune and what are the, yo, yo, this is lit dog. Yeah. And really you're not saying dog crap. And it is easier to get it put up on platforms so not nobody uh, can tell you, well, you know what? Try again before we put this out. Fam, before you had to have about a 10 racketies just to shoot a video. Yeah. Okay. That's very true. All right. Or at least two. At yeah. least two. Well, but these times it was film. Yeah. So, yeah. If you want to get on much music, if you yeah. want to get on MTV yeah. or whatever platform. Yeah, you had to have it on film. Yeah. And I See, that's the thing. I had my business correct. So, I would know. You make a video, it's going to go on YouTube, da, 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 da. then you have to film one just in case it goes over there to yeah. one of these. Come on. Because you're in that middle time where YouTube yeah. was already around. Yeah, but it but wasn't. there was still TV. There was still TV. Yeah. So, that, that's the grind to me. That was the grind. Like, yeah, yeah, you yeah. getting out there, selling your tape, doing what you got to do. You know, then just, yo, I could be in my mom Duke's basement, brother, and literally be like, yo, <laughs> yo, I have a mixtape coming out. You know what I mean? And nobody knows you from a can of paint. Yeah, man. Just what even last thing on this, this thing here, this, my question here, right? Yeah. I feel that back in the days, it was harder because of the fact that we had to do everything, quote unquote, analog. Mm-hmm. Like you were just mentioning, right? Yeah. You had to like run around, um, be at the spots if you want to get noticed. You Damn had right. to get a record deal if you wanted to get published. Yep. Or at least get some kind of production yep. deal with somebody who you now people can hear your music because they didn't yep. have social. We didn't have like social media where you could just that's upload what, your shit. So then that means you have to have talent. Yes. Mm. Right. But I feel that still now you have to have talent because there's so much of a saturation of shit. For you to stand out and be like, yeah, if top. you really want to stand out with everybody who could just upload their stuff easy to Instagram or mm-hmm. whatever, mm-hmm. like you better have a better marketing plan mm-hmm. and have like some music where it's like audiences are like engaged in some kind of way. Like you captivated people. It might not even always be the best, but you made people feel some kind of way. Yeah. Where they're like, yeah, I want to keep on hearing what this guy has to say. Yeah. Right. And you, Uh, but uh, you got to see that it's more accessible now than before someone actually patiently waited for you to finish that creation. Yes. Cause you also have to do more to make yourself known because you got to do all this online shit. For a lot of people, not everybody had the uh, the the, um, the blessings of being able to, you know, uh, put out their music and not have to put out a lot of fucking online content for people to go notice them and then stream their stuff. A lot of people don't have that liberty, bro. Mm-mm. You know what I'm saying? Most people have to put in the grind on their on their socials so that people will be able to go stream their music. You know what I'm saying? That's a lot harder too. That's a lot of work, fam. That's Even a though lot of work. we had to do the the campaigns, the, the t-shirts, work. and be at different places and stuff like that. These little niggas is like, yo, they, if they're not super social media savvy, they gotta go hire a nerd, <laughs> go on Fiverr or whatever. Yeah. If they don't know that, then find somebody to tell them that. Like what I'm saying right now, and like, yeah, yeah, you know what I'm saying? No, like, I know. It, it, it's a grind. So I think it's fifty fifty. I think it's fifty fifty yeah, yeah. in this case, right? Yeah, I think it's fifty fifty. I could we could argue about it all day, and we wouldn't come to a conclusion because yeah, it's a fifty fifty situation. It's like it's what you put into it is what you get back. Exactly. Well, no matter what year it is, you know what, what year saying? it is. Yeah. Well, listen. Salute to all the old school niggas and the new school niggas. Salute. Man. We love hip hop.